What do you do when you've run out of options and can't find medical help? We found a clinic specializing in an alternative health care here in Houston. Heights of Health is helping patients with everything from heart issues to hormones to headaches and just about everything in between. We found its history to be so interesting, we wanted to first share how this natural care center came about. It all started in a woman's home here in Houston. But this naturopath expanded her small business into a thriving center by turning several of her clients into colleagues. You helped me so much as far as my health and stuff like that. You know, my allergies have cleared up so much. Tracy Wigfield Southwick is a doctor of natural medicine and founder of the Heights of Health, a small bungalow tucked into the Heights area of Houston. She got into this business because of her own health issues. I was very young. I was in my early 20s and went from doctor to doctor. Um, trying to figure out what was going on, why I couldn't get out of bed, why I was so tired, why I was hurting all over. Um, and finally, um, an infectious disease doctor actually figured out that I had a virus and essentially said to me, this is what you're going to be dealing with for the rest of your life. You're going to be in and out of bed for the rest of your life. You'll never be able to hold down a job. Um, I can give you an antidepressant, and that's about it. Tracy was told she had Epstein-Barr virus, and as you heard, got that prescription for a bleak future. That's hard for a young bride to take. She knew she wasn't suffering from depression, though admits her diagnosis couldn't help but make her depressed. That is, until she just happened into a health food store. Of all places, she found her answers. A worker said they suspected she suffered from food sensitivities and candida, or yeast overgrowth, a common problem from taking antibiotics. They offered simple suggestions for her to at least try. So you, you radically changed your diet, and what happened? So I radically changed my diet, um, started taking the supplements. Within two weeks, I was out of bed. And I was, I was floored, and my whole family was floored, and everybody's going, what's going on? You know, was this all in her brain? But it really wasn't. I just had to change the, the fuel that I was giving to my body and give my body the right nutrients it needed to do the healing that it could do. This prompted Tracy to learn even more about natural health. These are some wonderful minerals that you she can... She began taking alternative health care courses. She also started looking for ways to help relieve food allergies because her daughter was so allergic to milk. That's where my focus kind of became um, turn towards allergies. When Tracy figured out a new technique to help others, she wanted everyone who suffered like her family to benefit. I felt like I found it. This is what I was supposed to do in life. So about a year later, I opened up a health food store in Fredericksburg. I had that for several years. I had a radio show out there, um, loved it. It was wonderful and, and circumstances changed in my life. And so I ended up moving back home to Houston where I was raised. Um, started seeing clients out of my home. Word of mouth spread quickly, and it grew so big, Tracy opened the Heights of Health. She handpicked several of her clients to work for her. She knew they'd be a perfect fit because they had experienced dramatic results from her help. They are so passionate about what they're doing, and they're so smart and so knowledgeable and so gifted. 